but more of PR should- <gasps> Tayo! Tayo! Oh my god! Hi there, Commanders! Guardian E here with another recap and reaction video for Azure Lane, this time for the 6th anniversary live stream for the Chinese server. Super hype, ready for some big news about the major Iron Blood event next week, hoping for some awesome reveals, some drool-worthy skins, all that jazz. And before we get started, I'll just briefly remind you that if you do enjoy the content that we put out on the channel, including Azure Lane videos, and you would like to help support us, please consider leaving a like, comment down below, subscribing for more. We really, really appreciate you. With that, let's get this show on the road. And right up front, we're treated to this uh, cute little intro with Amagi-chan and Cheshire-chan uh, frolicking in the beach. <laughs> The beach, so uh, by the waters, mountains in the back, so maybe a hint of uh, theming. They're going to continue the the beach theme, sw summer theme, swimsuit theme. Fingers crossed for that, because that is always a winner. Here we are, we're about to get started. And that, that is serious. Oh, serious looking beautiful as ever, okay. Thighs. Hot dogs. It looks like they're settling down for a, for a little meal by the beach, a little picnic by the beach. Prepared by Sirius. Aww. It's a nice setting. Oh. That voice. Are, are we gonna get the the big chonkin uh big chonkin CG Manju? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, we're getting a little greeting from the the different voice actresses. That's nice. Oh, all right, and getting uh getting one from Musashi too. Ugh, they had the uh, uh, shameful light beam and fog covering up her art. Oh, Yorktown as well. So it's interesting that they're choosing these specific skins uh, for the ships. I, I think they I guess they are all sort of anniversary themed skins in one way or another. So I guess that makes sense. Ah, uh, and Bismarck as well. All right. Quite appropriate that they would have Bismarck's uh, voice actress as part of this live stream. Oh my god! <laughs> they butchered the art! <laughs> god. All right, you know what? You know, they got to do what they got to do. You know, they got their regulations. Uh, at least, you know, we, we get it unadultered overseas. That's the important thing, so... Oh, we got Pinksway as well. Uh, and this is kind of cool because I think because it's a Dragon Emperor ship, they have the actual uh, Chinese voice actress here to actually introduce and, and greet as well, I think. Yeah, and similarly here as well. So again, I think it's kind of nice that they're they're able to kind of showcase uh, the voice actresses for, for this specific region. Now, if this year is anything like last year, uh, last year they like blitzed through the news. Um, they were like, they were going like light speed, so, uh, we want to be prepared for that for sure, because, because they move quick, they move quick here. So, this is going to be like a recap of the, of the last year, probably going through the, like, events and, and like, reveals and stuff. Oh, is this, is it going to be a, a trailer? And, oh, okay, so this is a, just a recap video, uh, going through the different events. All right. So I guess they might be doing it this way instead of the big CG Manju. Just have like little, little avatar icons at the bottom. <laughs> I think that's fine. All right, so they yeah they are going through some statistics here. Uh, I'm gonna keep stills of each of these stats up just so that for future reference. Uh, I'm trying to translate it as it goes live, but I'm not being too successful here. Okay, so this is the number of commanders who have completed all PR research. Uh, this is the number of commanders that have cleared in large scale battles. Chapter 5. Alright, so we got top 3 here. Alright, so those are the top 3 built PR ships on the Chinese server. Very nice choice. Uh, I believe these are going to be the top 10 oaths as well. These are all very solid choices, I have to say. It's nice seeing Newcomer Implacable up there in the top 10. Uh, New Jersey, Musashi, Vanguard, yeah, yeah. A whole lot of, a whole lot of UR and PR representation in that top 10. Okay, so I think these are the top 10 skins that were purchased in the last year, so a lot of really great ones in here. Getting some collab skins too, Ryza, uh, Implacable making another appearance, Yorktown 2 absolutely uh, deserves her spot. Uh, both of them, Taiho is nice to see, Aegir up there, uh, yes of course we have Shinano and Aegir, both of them uh, topping out the charts, both very very well deserved. I think both of them have I think the most interactions out of any skins, so makes a lot of sense. Aegir actually <laughs> appearing twice in the top three, 
Uh, yeah. What a gorgeous ship. Makes total sense to me. All right, the next segment coming up. Sixth anniversary live. So this might be the in-game news. Maybe the next event reveal. Okay, some some nice little rewards. Okay, that's always appreciated. Little little bonus gifts. And generally speaking, even though it's for a specific server celebration, all of the servers usually get those rewards. Uh, so even though there's no guarantees, I would expect that we would get them on the global server as well. Uh, these as well, getting some gems. Yeah, that that might be exclusive to the Chinese server. I don't know. I, I can't remember if they give out gems to everybody uh, for one server's anniversary or not. Oh, all right. Getting a little trailer. Oh, some sun in the fun. Some swimsuits. I thought I saw. Okay, all right. Some luck. <laughs> Getting formidable and Cheshire there. Wait, what? Wait, that was it? Was that just like a little tease or something? That like cut off really abruptly. I want to see more. Show us more. Maybe it'll be on YouTube or something, the, the full uh, the full animation. Oh, there's a Manju making an appearance. All right, and then bringing up... So this is part two, sixth anniversary content. So this is going to be, I think, the in-game stuff. Oh, so is this going to be the setting for the anniversary? It's like a world map. Is it just like an entire new like type of little mini event? That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, so it's like a summer uninhabited island. And then uh, what we're seeing here is like the hub. This is like the typical hub that you would see with an event. Um, so you can navigate to all the different areas uh, and mini games of the event. But yeah, so it's it seems like it's going to be more expansive than just like the typical hub like this. There's actually going to be another component to it. Yeah. <laughs> look, look these little Akashis. Okay, so this is we're getting a little preview of the uh, of a mini game. Oh, here we go. Okay, we get a little. So they're mining. So we have to. Oh, it's like um, it's like Frogger. It's like Frogger. You have to go and collect the minerals uh, while avoiding all of the hazards. Okay. All right. I see. Oh, <laughs> look at the panda haunt you. <laughs> That's fun. And then uh, okay, so these this is gonna be the gear skins. Uh, I got some, like there's like a slipper, uh, some uh, knives. There's like a, a sun hat there. Uh, and then here are the actual dorm. Uh, furniture sets that are going to go live. It looks like so there's two variations So there are they gonna release two whole sets? That's actually pretty cool One of them looks like it's like sort of in a cave or a grotto and the other one is more open in a town Okay, so here's the splash page for the next event starting on the 25th of May as we anticipated uh, And it is going to be iron blood themed look at that iron blood uh, logo uh, emblazoned behind the actual uh, text there. Oh, okay, so here is the first ship reveal, light, craft, uh, light aircraft carrier. Okay, alright, she's cute. I don't see her name written anywhere, and I, I can't even tell if she's uh, a gold ship or a purple ship. Uh, <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> alright, so they completely covered her up here, uh, but this is another one of the new ships as well. Uh, I, I certainly would like to see her without the fog uh, right there, uh, and I'm sure we'll see soon enough. But um, I like the sly smile that she has. I, I'm guessing she is going to be a submarine. Oh, whoa, look at that dragon. That is badass. Sprouting out of the magma like that, that is so cool. And her, uh, so she, first of all, <laughs> you can't make up any details of her body, which is a good sign, because that means that she's probably wearing something very scandalous. Um, but yeah, I mean, but otherwise, like, her her pose and design and the fact that she's just floating there with the sprout, with the uh, wings spread right in front of this huge dragon is really cool. Uh, can't wait to see the full art there. Uh, okay, so this is going to be the meta ship. This is going to be actually a meta submarine that's uh, going to drop with the event. I, I don't... Have we gotten a, a meta submarine before? I don't think so. This might be the first... Okay. Oh, okay. So, oh, <laughs> look at the look at the rigging. The rigging is getting more and more nutso every time. Wow. Okay. So this was actually the character that was silhouetted on the uh, the preview page, and this is going to be Audria Zwei. I'm gonna try to have the ship names uh, up at the top. 
because um, obviously I can't catch all of them here while we're watching live. Um, but I'll try to make sure to add that in editing so that um, so we have the proper names of the ships. I, I mean, it's hard to make out the details of her because she's so small since the rigging is so enormous. I feel like they should have done like um, like two zooms to, so you could see uh, her in addition to the actual ship. But uh, but from what I see, I'm liking it. The jet black outfit, the very short skirt, uh, the fur fur uh, lining as well. Oh. Oh, okay, so this is... Who is this? Oh, so I think this is going to be a Nelson retrofit? Is that right? That's pretty cool. That's pretty nice. I like Nelson. I like Nelson a lot. OG Nelson. That's pretty great. Again, the art itself, it's its all covered up, but she is, it does look like she's stepping on us. Which is, uh... It's on the, oh, whoa, okay, wait. 2023 anniversary swims... Okay, so confirm they are doing swimsuits. Oh, okay, that was Jade. Um, this was the new. This was the new ship, right? I think this was the new ship. Ray. Okay, Regensburg. Regensburg. So that's that's one of the new uh, ships as well. Bismarck's way. So it was Bismarck's way. Okay, all right. So that's Manchester as well. All right. So they, they're flying through these, and you can't see anything because they're all swimsuits. Ticonderoga. I'm so thrilled that they're bringing back swimsuits. That is hype, of course. Royal Fortune. Oh, that's hype. Uh, her her pose is a little provocative too under the table there. Uh, Sakawa, Sakawa is the only one that hasn't been censored. <laughs> Anchorage. Okay, so the PR ships, the uh, more of PR ship. <gasps> Tayo, Tayo. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, is is this live 2D? How do we talk? New Jersey, New Jersey. Oh my. Sheesh. Oh my. <laughs> Showing off that world class backside. America's ass. This lineup is crazy. Tons and tons of skins, swimsuit skins. Uh, unfortunately, I like, can't see anything, but um, I, I I can't wait to see the full versions. Cannot wait to see the full version. Taiho, Taiho swimsuit. I've been waiting for a swimsuit Taiho like forever, forever, and they they finally did it. New Jersey as well. I'm I'm hoping that Taiho and New Jersey are at least dynamic, if not live 2D. Um, New Jersey has deserved an animated skin forever. Uh, Taiho has plenty of animated skins, but I, she deserves another one. I mean, it just looks so good uh, in that I, I can't wait to see her swimsuit reveal uh, in all its glory. Okay, so I think that was just like the return of, uh, of, uh, of past skins for the celebration, the return of past dorm sets for the celebration as well on the Chinese server that may not bleed over into the other servers because we're going to get, you know, that sort of stuff on our own timeline. Okay, all right, so they're, they're flipping through these a little bit more now. So that was Bismarck. I, the, my translator was, like, totally off. Okay, um, okay. Sakawa, so Sakawa's the only one that's not censored here. Uh, Anchorage, oh, she's riding the Orca floaty. That's cool. I, I, I'm so hype. I am so hype for Taiho Swimsuit. I can't wait. I can't wait. New Jersey, mega hyped as well. I can't wait for either of them. She's She's been wearing the little, uh, the little stylish glasses as well, the sunglasses. Super hype. All right, so this is part two content. Uh, oh, a oh, part two. Wait, oh, is that Taiho, Taiho Chan? Taiho Chan, and then another meta ship. So this, okay, so again, they're blitzing through this. Um, whoa, what is this? Oh, is this going to be part of the cruise pass? That's a great cruise pass skin. That's a really good cruise pass skin. That's one of the best cruise pass skins we've gotten so far. Uh, for Kaga, that looks great. And I think like immediately before there was a a little Taiho or Taiho Chan, so we are getting a, a mini version of Taiho. Taiho enjoyers are eating good. I count me as one of them. So, and then uh, wait, what's this concert dinner party? So there's a whole bunch of skins for the concert. What Ayanami as well? Okay, all right. And then unicorn. Uh, so yeah, uh, again they're not they're not holding. Oh, Prince Heinrich too. Wow. I can't wait to see that full reveal. I, wait, okay. <laughs> looks fantastic. Illustrious, Lusty 2 playing the harp. Oh, wow. So there's going to be two waves of skins. Oh, Amagi getting another skin too. Okay, so here's here's the full, uh, the full set here. Oh, man. So this is going to be the second set of skins. So the first set is... Oh, okay. Cleveland, Clevebro as conductor. That's actually really fitting. I, I like that a lot. That looks great on her, actually. It's, it's very fitting for her. Uh, and then it looks like there's going to be anniversary packs in the store, so you can get one of the skins uh, randomized 
uh, honestly, my, my like head's spinning because they move through, through these so fast. You can't even have time to digest it. But but we're getting swimsuits again, and then we're getting dresses again, which are two of the two of the best themes for skins, uh, in my personal opinion. Uh, so that that's really great. Um, and they've got some really choice ships in those selections, uh, and really can't wait. Uh, so what is this? He's humming. Now. Is, does he, this mean oath skins? Because it sounded like he was humming the. Um, the oh okay yes it is it is oath skins it is oath skins all right so great it's always good to see oh that's that's sweet dan 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 so getting a set a set of three oath skins here okay and there is going to be a ring pack available in the store of course uh, one of the two packs where you buy two for like 980 gems something like that so a little discount there for the package. It's always nice when they do oat skins. It's always appreciated. I always think that they should really go harder on those. Wait, wait, wait. So this, this is another meta ship? Whoa, look at like the Xenomorph claw behind her. That's so trippy. So so this is another meta ship. I don't know how we acquired this one. Maybe this is after the last one. Because we've already gotten at least two meta reveals, right? And then this is the third meta reveal. So I, I'm not 100% sure how we get this one. All right, so we're getting a little game preview here. Uh, I think they're just doing some visual improvements. Yeah, some graphic optimization. So they're adding some visual effects. Look, like there's they're increasing the fog element to it, adding some background elements to the actual uh, combat stages as well. All right, yeah, smoothing things out, making it a little bit better. They actually have been uh, they have been improving the chibis a lot lately. Like they've been going back and like reworking some of them. So it's all like. They've been kind of like just working on this in the background, and uh, and it's nice. It's it's like nice little touches. Always, it's always appreciated. All right, so it says something about optimization interface. So they're, they're in. Oh, okay, so they're. Uh, okay, so they're making the uh, the actual end screen a little bit flashier, with more information and stuff. That, oh, that's okay. All right, what's next? This is gonna be an actual animated trailer. Uh, okay. Oh, I think this is just uh, maybe previewing the new voice act uh, and of course adding for consistency uh, the voices for the skins as well. Makes makes a lot of sense. Okay, and I'll hear, there's the full lineup. All of the skins are going to be getting new voices, so that's good. Alright, so this is going to be uh, an equipment research and development update. Alright, so these are going to be available via research. Oh, okay, so they're adding meta ships so that they increase fleet technology. That's great. That's actually really nice. And there is going to be a new challenge mode that's coming. Oh, is this like a little arcade where you can play the different mini games? That's really cool. If they, do, that's really cool. I, I've, I've, uh, that's been on my wish list for sure. Just having a little hub to play the different past mini games. All right, so they are making optimizations to selling ships as well. Uh, I'm not 100% sure what this is. It might be something physical on location, like at the, uh, in China, some sort of a celebration. It looks like this is advertising some tea. So I, I think it's a collaboration then. Okay, so it looks like a collaboration with Millennium T, I think it looks like. Uh, so it does look like this skin is going to be part of this collaboration, and she'll have voice lines at launch, it looks like. Now, I'm pretty confident in assuming that we will also get this overseas, just because I think the, the last like Panda collaboration in China, we, we did get those skins overseas. So I, I'm thinking we would get this one too. All right, and this is an Agile Link collaboration with a museum. So this is like different soundscapes. Oh, okay, and there's going to be a skin uh, as part of that collaboration too, which makes a lot of sense. Composition of this one is really beautiful. Really love the hyper-traditional painting style in the back, and then her pose as well as the uh, the long-flowing uh, skirt tail is, is just really attractive overall. Alright, so here's the schedule of events uh, that are currently happening. Oh, getting a phone call. Huh? Oh, there's... Here's the Mr. Manju. All right, what is on the table here? Uh, all right. All right, so these are future updates. Okay, so they are optimizing the SOS, the sea rescue uh, elements to the game. So I think they're planning on increasing the number of tries, if I saw that correctly, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, they're also going to be adjusting the Operation Siren shops uh, at each of the ports too, so that's going to be that's going to get a little overhaul. Uh, and they're going to adjust how daily missions work in Operation Siren as well. Oh, so there's going to be an equipment sharing function. 
in the game. That's actually pretty cool. So I, it looks like there might be loadouts that you can um, that you can set. Maybe you can share certain loadouts with other ships. So that's that would actually be pretty nice. So you can have kind of like a set, you know, a, a set established loadout, and then and then just move it around to different ships. Oh, so they're adding what so it sounds like it's a whisper function, like a private time function with the ship. Oh, that sounds awesome. And I think from the translation, it's binaural, so it's like meant to be a little ASMR-ish as well. That's amazing. Really? So, so, wow. As an ASMR enthusiast myself, I have to say that is stellar. I love that. I absolutely love that. I don't know... I don't know how wide-reaching they're going to make this update. I, I hope that they go wild with it, because honestly, that's amazing. I mean, I, and I don't know if it's locked behind, you know, a certain affection level or maybe oathing them or something. I, I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, so a little, a little private whisper time with the ship girls where you get a little ASMR treatment. That sounds heavenly. That sounds heavenly. I mean, I really hope it's not China only, uh, because the the one that they decided to showcase here, obviously, is uh, the Chinese voice actress. Navigator Development Program. The Navigator, who's been silently supporting the Commander, seems to be a little annoyed recently. Commander, do you always feel that I lack personality? It should be a good idea to slowly form a special character in a relaxed daily life. So this is like a day in the life with uh, with TB. <laughs> You're, so is it kind of like a Tamagotchi, where you go in and like take care of her and you know her stats increase and you like feed her and like take her for a walk and stuff i don't know that's definitely a fun and unique way to to add a dimension and a connection from the player to the character i think that could be kind of cool mysterious faction sp so we're going to be getting some special events that are mysterious uh towards the end of 2023 or in the last half of 2023 so i'm trying to like we're getting little teasers here is that jean bart on the first one I'm not entirely sure. It kind of looks like she has a pirate hat, though. So it might be more Tempesta. That, that could be a thing. Um, I can't really tell. Uh, at the bottom, it looks like Shirayuki, maybe? I'm not entirely sure. Uh, yeah, more, more to come on these. It's kind of interesting. We didn't get an animated preview of the new event, right? We, we only got an animated preview of... Uh... Oh, okay. So this is a little closing out video? Featuring some some hijinks, <laughs> featuring some hijinks from the the little ships. That's very cute. Oh, there's Akashi making her first appearance of the live stream here. Ooh, what is that? Some refreshing beverage. It, so it's interesting. We didn't get an animated preview of the event itself. We got an animated preview of like. The summer. Uh, the summer, like, theming, but not the actual event. I, that might be forthcoming later. Because um, we usually do, even, like, if it doesn't get shown on a live stream, we usually do get an animated little segment um, trailer for the actual event itself. Oh, what, 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 a little stop motion? Stop motion formidable? Oh, so this is an actual, this is an actual commercial. It's an actual collaboration with uh, I, I, some beverage company. Okay, all right. Apparently, we got formidable Chan enjoying a uh, little uh, orange beverage here. What's what's little Cheshire doing? Oh, she's still, like doing a little dance. That's cute. Are those like chocolates around her? Is this an, this might be another collaboration or like another commercial? I don't know. She's doing the bus driver. <laughs> oh yeah. So I think that I think that was. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's exactly what it was. Uh, collaboration between Azure Lane and Made Jump Goods. All right. And oh, okay. So we are getting the full animated preview, summer preview. Wow. Ulrich von Houten rocking that swimsuit, but we don't actually get to see. Oh, wait. There's more. Got serious making some cocktails. Well, I guess they're not cocktails if she's serving them to the little ones. <laughs> This live stream keeps faking me out because they keep like waving and saying goodbye, but then they like come back like immediately after. So I don't know. I don't know when this thing's gonna end. Okay, Juju Island. Juju. Oh, okay, so this is like a T Mall. It's like a specifically a T Mall uh, shop for Agilene merch. It looks like. 
They're gonna, oh, they're gonna, okay, so they're gonna have some products associated with, like, all right, so this is some of the merchandise that they are going to be featuring here. Oh, that's, <laughs> that's funny. That's a fun, that's a fun shirt. Representing some uh, Harbin, some Taiho. So it, it does look like some of the merch does incorporate, like, the new art for this particular, like, event. Um, and some of it is, like, splash art from that we've seen before. Oh my god, I need I need to see that Taiho full art. I need to see that Taiho full art. I need to see that New Jersey full art. Look at how they like look at how they did my girl Prince Heinrich dirty. Look, look yeah, they're like covering him up with uh with what are those like sponges? What are those? <laughs> uh, but anyway, yeah, they're showcasing a bunch of the merch. It looks like, it looks like these are probably like buttons or something. I will say the one thing about the censorship of the live stream is that the more fog and strips that you see on uh, on the character, the more encouraging and hype I get because because clearly that means what they're wearing is has to be pretty spicy. So yeah, and they're already featuring like the new art for the the um, concert dresses, the oath skins here. Oh, what is this? This is really cool. Are, are those like oath cards? And uh, might be what a commemorative uh, coin that you can like flip. It's in one of those little spinners. And then, what is, oh, this is like a little, like, bracelet or choker. Oh, what, what is this? This is, look at that mouse pad. It's huge. It's huge. I've seen those before on Twitter, but I didn't, I, I would not expect, I would have not have expected to see an official release of one of those mouse pads. <laughs> Basically, like, the full, the full body mouse pads. Oh, okay, and they're showing off the Nendoroid. So, part of the... A Good Smile Company Shanghai collection here. So New Jersey is going to be a part of it. Ayanami is going to be added to it as well. Uh, we already have Laffy. She's uh, been out for a while now. Cheshire, I believe, also has been out for a while, if I'm not mistaken. And Unicorn. <laughs> These are cute. So uh, I think New Jersey might be the newest of the line. And there she goes. <laughs> um, and I don't know if uh, I don't know if she's still available or they closed pre-orders already. But um, Laffy. <laughs> Yeah, pretty cute, pretty cute. Okay, so pre-orders are currently up for Cheshire then. And it cut, the perfect cut cuts right back to Cheshire here. Oh, <laughs> that's that's very adorable. Oh, hello, Sirius. Wipe us down a little bit. Thank you. Uh oh. <clears throat> okay, so we. Uh, Oh, this is the first reveal of the prototype for uh, New Jersey's Oath skin by Apex Toys. All right, Apex pulling out the stops here. They are also doing these little Justagram chibis uh, based upon the like the Justagrams in the game, like that art, that art style. So they've got uh, New Jersey in her little her little bunny suit, and you also have Noshiro in her maid costume. Uh, and then we are getting... Oh, from Annie Game. Yeah, they did reveal that they were making a Taiho Oath skin. So does, this is going to be the first reveal of the prototype, which is heavily censored. Uh, but pre-orders are going to start on the 25th. What's Amagi-chan doing down there? She... What? Oh, wow, she drew... Wow, she's very talented. She drew all of that. <laughs> what? Is this perfume? Okay, so it's more collaboration merch, so this is obviously based on uh, one of the other collaborations that they announced before, but it's like a gift box. Uh, so it features like a tea glass and a metal bookmark, it said, and uh, looks like this one's some note stationery and a bookmark as well, so that's nice. <laughs> Aww. Is, is uh, this one one of the Manju cats? Wow, they are living good. They're living way better than I am. And it's a cute little, a cute little peek into their offices. All of these cats are so photogenic. You all already know that all of these cats had like a day at the salon before they shot this. They all, they all look impeccable. Oh, hey. Hello. No. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. In all seriousness, I could watch cats and dogs like all day. So I'm 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 just vibing. That's it's fine by me. Oh, there's the Maju. Making another appearance. Okay. Uh is this just a continuation of the uh the Seiyu greetings from the beginning of the live stream? 
Oh, okay, I guess so. These are little just like voice clip congratulations from uh, from the different voice actresses. Oh, hey, Tayo! All right. And they're actually previewing the uh, the art too. I'm like squinting really really hard to try to try to pierce the fog, trying desperately to pierce the fog. <laughs> I mean, she is wearing a two-piece. Can tell that right out of the gate. Can't make out much more. Can't even really make out the color of the swimsuit itself. So it, it does look like the shirt that she's wearing isn't tied. It looks like it is open, which is encouraging. And uh, it looks like she's got uh, some some magazines at her side, one of them featuring Serkov as well, which is nice. Uh, also, of course, drawn by Yun Song, so uh, definitely on theme there. Taiho ASMR Wen, Yostar, Manju. Matane! Ooh, Shinano! I like. <laughs> Her race queen skin is just one big fog blob. <laughs> it's just... Oh man, Shinano ASMR win too. I'm sorry if people are getting tired of me saying that. I'm just, I'm just a fan, so I would love to hear it. And oh, it's serious. And she's, <laughs> she's blocked. She's blocked there. Jump to the breeze. Uh, is this a song that's playing in the um, in the trailer or something? I, I didn't catch it, so I guess that's possible. A little congratulations from the artists as well. Okay, is that a wrap? Cut. I am hoping they like kind of scroll through the different um, reveals quickly at the end. That's always nice. Oh. Whoa. That zoom. Is she gonna be conducting? Is she gonna be singing? Wow, so this is like a live perf organ performance, like a concert performance. Oh, this is the oath music. So they're, they're playing the uh, the oathing music live. Oh, <laughs> all right. Is Sirius going to be doing the oh? Oh, she's what? She's doing a little dance performance. Oh, that's cool. So graceful. I thought Sirius was like a little clumsy. She's really, she's really pulling it off here. All right, go Sirius. Go, go orchestra. All right, starting on May 25th, the sixth anniversary celebration. And there is that Bismarck Zway. Okay, well, I guess that's how they're gonna be closing things out. That little dance and tribute. We didn't get a whole heck of a lot of information about the event itself. I actually just checked on my phone, um, it, but it does look like the animated preview is available. Um, so we might go ahead and watch that. But, you know, it's kind of interesting that they didn't have that uh, ready, I guess, for the live stream. All right, well, the animated event preview is up, so let's go ahead and just watch that together. We may as well to kind of close things out uh, for the event proper. And, and yeah. So, the sands of time. Oh, U557. All oh, those wings are crazy. Oh, the flash of the eyes. She looks so cool. And that giant dragon in the back is awesome. Oh, that's great. That's great. All right. Well, that that's all she wrote. I, I live streams over. Uh, that's the uh, recap and reaction. I mean, I. I'm hype. I'm hype for the new event. I, I'm eager to see kind of how things unfold. I think Bismarck's Way looks great. She is an ultra rare ship and uh, the other ships as well. Can't wait for the new skin drop and seeing the new skins in all of their glory. Gotta get them. <laughs> Gotta get a closer look at them. Um, naturally, on the 25th is when the event drops, and uh, of course, we're gonna we will be putting out a uh, day one pull video and skin review video uh, for the drop that happens at that time on the 25th. So if you are interested in that, of course, um, you know, subscribe to the channel so that you do get notified when that goes live. But otherwise, 
yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited with the selection. We'll, we'll have to see um, more as details get revealed. But uh, let me know in the comments down below your impressions of the live stream, the events, the reveals, and everything else. Um, there were some interesting game modes, a lot of future updates that I'm looking forward to, like that ASMR and, uh, and other just quality of life changes that they revealed. Um, the live stream format itself, you know, they it's a lot more condensed than the Japanese live streams. They only last like a, an hour and 30 minutes, I think, effectively. And, um, but they're... I gotta say, there is a lot of filler. Like, the gameplay and the actual reveal elements is, like, a tiny, tiny portion of the live stream. I feel like they could they could lend a little bit more time to, to that stuff. Because, like I said, this preview wasn't even, like, in the live stream. We had to go and watch it separately, so... But that being said, that's just nitpicking. I mean, I, I, I did enjoy myself. I enjoyed the reveals. I enjoyed uh, uh, all of the anticipation and the news. Uh, but let me know what your thoughts were down below. Uh, hopefully you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please feel free to leave us a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more Azure Lane content. We thank you all so much for watching, for taking time out of your day to spend with us. We really do appreciate it. And until next time, let's protect those waters.